everything is a wisdom behind Islam. Marriage is a protection. It protects you from fornication. And I, I'm be I understand sometimes young brothers, I've seen the faces, like, oh boy, when I don't have $50,000, now I'm trying to get married. Dad wants me to buy his daughter a plane. <laughs> I can't afford no plane. I understand. <laughs> Stop a little hard. <laughs> You know, but you know, it's a protection. It's a protection. Sisters as well. When the law commanded you to guard your modesty, this is a protection. You don't have to worry about a guy intoxicated running up, hugging you, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I guarantee you, we're next to nothing. The man can't control himself. It ain't his fault. He's looking like. You know, it starts from a genuine hug, then a squeeze, and he might try to swing his hands past real quick or something crazy. <laughs> Stuff from love. This is a protection. It's wisdom behind this religion. And we don't need to be trying to, you know, figure it out no other way. Allah gave you the test and the answers. You have the Quran, you have the Sunnah. That's it. If Islam was an airline, all you need what? Two carry-on bags. Quran, Sunnah. I've been in that airport and I've seen some very miskeen families, subhanAllah. 18 boxes, the house lamp, they got a bird cage, and all. where you going with all this stuff? And you wonder why you're sitting in the airport for three days. But this flight is going to Jannah. Only thing required, two carry-on bags. That's it. The bird cage and the mother boxes is waiting for you in your destination. Bigger boxes. Bigger cats. You can walk around with lions. You don't need kittens. This is gender. And then like this has to soften your heart every day to know that first and foremost Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, his promise is true. His promise is true. You may have good intentions, Mark. No, okay, you may have great intentions. But you're deficient. I say meet me at six, you get there at seven. Was I wrong for believing in you? No, all your intentions were sincere, but were there any guarantee? That. But if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, say be somewhere at six, I know Allah is already there. His promise is true. And this is where we have to wake up. 